Hey guys, welcome back to Gina Not Gina Productions. I'm Gina Not Gina, back playing Outlast Whistleblower Part 10. Yeah, yeah, Part 10. And uh, we are outside in the fog and we just met our beautiful naked twins again. And we have missed them greatly. So yeah, we have that to look forward to in the near future. I'm gonna sip a sip in my tea. When I say sippy sip, I more mean take huge manly gulps of it. Anyway, so we just came up a ladder where our twinsies were. So, oh, I can see the open door on the other side. Why am I so scared about this? I really don't like that. Uh, Come on, all. Bad reading time. From J. Billings to K. Vigilando. Patient small. Kurt, we've got another one, and I'm not sure we're going to be able to check it off as a psychopathic proximity disorder. Security guards all the way up to the admin block. Uh, security guard all the way up in the admin block is our latest non patient employee to start seeing the Wernicke's fairy tales. He was never directly exposed to the engine, never ever made. Never even made it below level one into the building. It would be an enormous breach of protocol and security if doctors were speaking of the wall rider within the hearing of the contracted security guard. It seems vanishingly improbable that he would be he would stumble onto such an obscure mythological story on his own. It's too similar to Dr. Samuel's case or the others before him. It's one thing for a formally sane medical professional to fall under delusions of their patients. It's another thing entirely for those whose beliefs to be, I don't know, airborne. We need to talk in person. Billings. That's because the wall rider ain't nothing of symbols. And nothing to fucking joke around with, brah. Like, it's because wall rider equals bad. I have, this looks like a hallway of fucks right here. Hallway of fucks. Hallway of fucks, hallway of fucks. I am prepared for some fucking in my bum. What's over here? What's going on down here? Hello? What the fuck? Uh, not even any batteries in here. What's the point of this room? And then they tease me with the possibility of batteries. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't like this. I can't hide from what? From who? From where? Why would I need to? Trust them. They'll tell you it's science. It's not. They were waiting for us in this place. Billy understood. They've always been here. Mm hmm. Really, I'm not going to write anything about that. That disappoints me. Hi, bro. See, you seem cool. I like you. You've got pants. You're not trying to eat me. See, you're cool. You know what? If I get out of here, I'm coming back for you, bro. I'm, that don't 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 take anything from that. That's that's not at all what I meant to do. Okay, so just don't don't take that to heart. What I just did. What's in here? Opening doors is one of the scariest things in this game. I'm like, I'm never sure. Oh, like that. What? What is going on? Things are getting awfully loud. Oh, 
Okay. is talking. That looks like a good door for a marinara to bust through. I'll bet you money. I don't have any money. I won't bet you any money. I literally none. None. No monies. I have nothing. Okay, shut this. Come on, we gotta do this. All right, here we go. You fucking dickhole! Well, I didn't see that happen. That happening. Ow. Oh, where? Marinara, help me! Marinara, help me! Marinara, help me! Marinara, help me! Come on, Marinara! Chris Walker, Wall Rider, Nikki Twins. That's Chris Walker. Do me a favor and die here, Mark. That was Chris Walker. I know Chris Walker sounds. Oh fuck. That is definitely Chris Walker. You know what? I said I might want Chris Walker back. I don't. I don't think I do. Uh. What? Uh, does that mean you're on my side or you're still gonna chop my head off? I don't understand what's happening. Are you or are you not going to kill me? Should I trust you? I'm going to trust you. Oh god. Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay, yeah, you're not going to help me. I need a squeezy hole. Sorry, I'm sorry, Chris. I'm sorry. I know your fate, by the way. You're gonna get squished from the inside. Okay. Uh -huh. I'm sure that's gonna happen. You know, I don't understand, though. Like, when I hid... He knew he saw where I went, but he didn't. Okay, wait. Hold that off for a second. What is over here? Hey! I think I might know where I am. Let's see what's over here first. Holly, fuck you, Niss. Hi. <laughs> And Magic, you think it was technology? We have faith in all the wrong things. Uh huh? And it will destroy us. The doctor told me, once the official cave band, our technology, you would think it was magic. And if you show on and Magic, you think it was technology. It makes a very good point. We have faith in all the wrong things. And it will destroy us. It makes a very good point. I'll just leave you in your little bathroom. 
Yeah, no, I think I know where we are. This is gonna sit down the drink. Another poor soul. Ah! Don't be afraid, you're doing this. Hello! Whether you know it or not. Hello, crazy. Yep, 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 Miles. Miles. I wonder if I'll get to see Miles at the end of this. Uh, what did I write? Down, down, down. Somebody who looks as much like a priest as this place looks like an asylum, writing instructions on the wall, talking about God. Tells me not to be afraid. How was ever a part of this inhuman bullshit, greed-driven, moral genocide? The monsters Murkoff ripped from the tortured mines, the lengths their jackbooted business school worms will go to protect it. Their own men slaughtered. I've never prayed in my life, Lisa, but if some small-minded interventionist god is listening, kill Jeremy Blair before I die. Sanity and avarice? avarice? There's no pain he does not deserve. I agree with that. There is no radio. No hope of reaching the outside world. Only escape. Well, if I learned anything from Miles Upshur, it is that... Oh, great. This shit is starting again. I know where I am, kind of. Hey, I wonder if this is going to say uh, Blair to Traeger. Oh, fuck. Traeger's alive. God. Fuck. Rick, fun hitting the greens. Fun hitting the greens last week. We should make it a you should make the drive more often. I was reviewing some old test records from the early days of Project Wall Rider and something sparked my interest. Were you following the project back in 2010? Apparently we had issues with female employees experiencing psychosomatic pre pregnancies. Something to do with how the morphogenic engine interacts with the immune system. All Greek to me, am I right? It was more often fatal than not, and these were employees and not patients, so a little harder to sweep under the rug. But the morphogenic engine activities activity in these in these ladies morrow was off the charts and these are women who were never had never been exposed to additional hormone therapy now i don't know ppm from a kick in the teeth but i can read the spreadsheet if the project if the projected profits from project wall Raider are half of what they say they are i've got just one question why aren't we performing experiments on women why aren't we performing experiments on women? God knows mental illness is an equal opportunity aff affliction. It seems unethical to pass up on such a potential windfall. You people are so fucked up. Hi. I'm sorry, dude. I really, like, you all suck, but I really do feel bad for you. You talked to me about experience, experiments last time. What? It's a mean thing to say. Hey, yep, I know exactly where he is. I hid in these lockers right here. I knows exactly where I is. Oh, but this is all blocked now. It sucks because I know what's down there. Hello? Hello? Yeah, I know. This makes me happy that I'm somewhere. Patrice, sorry, Miles. This isn't going to be here for you anymore. I took it for myself. I'd like you to stay quiet. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Anyway. I'm about to reach time again. But now that I'm not fucking constantly being chased by asshole sawface, I actually want to play. It's all good. It's all good. 
It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Oh, did I done goof? Get out here. Woo! Okay, perfect. That was perfect stopping time. All right, guys. Um, so, yeah, we are actually making some progress. Um, like in the last episode, I'm really sorry. There was a few episodes in this session that were just me hiding from Marinara. And I'm sorry. But you know what? You try playing it. It's not as easy as you think. It is like an anxiety attack on steroids. So, anyway. Um, yeah. Uh, I love you guys. And thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah. I hope you like my hair. And I will see you guys in the next episode. And like, favorite, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye.